All right, let's take a look around these firms in our lovely capitalism world and take a look at mines throughout this whole world of Dubai and Houston, which apparently seems to be Earth according to my, my current game. We have two mines and our friends from iWatch have one of chemical minerals. That's actually starting to make a profit, however, the lifetime profit is negative. Our gold mine has made us a quarter of a billion bucks, which is quite fascinating. It won't last long because it's down to a reserve of 10, so I'm actually changing my mine and I will probably set up a second gold mine to keep things running for now. And as for our silica mine, it's making a loss, but it is uh, getting lots of businesses available for everybody. So that's not fair. Demand is actually quite high, so I'm going to set up an inventory, double up mining, and sales. Not only that, but we will also increase prices. Quarter of a dollar. Sounds fair to me. Now going back to the firms, you have no logging camps, you have no oil wells. Now media firm, this is very interesting. Dubai has three. I have a radio station available for sale, which is interesting. But in Houston, which is our main city, we have four firms. We own one, but two are for sale. What I can do is attempt to get this guy to not be so great in terms of profit and hopefully buy it as well. And if I manage to get a monopoly, then anybody that wants to get a brand rating will have to give us some nice dosh. Now, if they don't want to, that's fine but they will suffer with our competition because our products will be really, really high in brand awareness and brand loyalty as a consequence. So I'm gonna actually buy these guys. 146, can you do it for 144? Great. I'm gonna turn down your budget. 100,000, increase your price immediately to 320. And for the radio station, 200 million. Great. I'm going to put your rating, your investment to uh, 95, sure. I want to keep that newspaper station under pressure. Prices, as you can see, everybody loves advertising with us. Put you to 240. I don't want to go too high because otherwise people are going to migrate to this newspaper station, which is not what I want. I want them to go actually close to bankrupt. Great. So we've made a move. Now our next move, we're still with over 600, almost 600 million. So I am going to set up that gold mine right here. We had discussed in a very, very early episode. Quality a little bit lower than our current one, but the reserve, it's fine at 91. So I am going to go on and reserve you. It'll cost us 20 million. Now we're not, oh, I don't think I'll set you up yet. Be ready as soon as the other mine goes out of stock. Down to a reserve of nine. We'll turn you on. So our factory. Selling to a couple of guys. I mean, I watch basically. Not keeping up with demand, which is interesting. If we're going to train you, why not? And if I'm going to keep you up, I'm going to want technology I cannot stay behind I mean I cannot stay that far behind as I am currently uh, they they're at like over 200 and I'm at 160 gold ring technology at 256 we're gonna want to catch up how soon well your project will help a lot so I'm gonna go with that try to catch up quickly as possible Oh yes, excellent. Another thing I noticed is, well, our grape juice factory, they're selling to ourselves, that's great. But our wine, making nice cash, but we're selling to a lot of people. And we're selling quality of 99, which I think is actually 100, should be 100. Why is there a raw material at 54? Grapes, coming in at 100, inventory 100. Glass, oh yeah, glass, okay. So, have you ever rejected a bottle of wine because the glass was not good enough? Well, I'm losing a point because of that. Anyway, we are selling them a 99 level wine, which is the best in the universe. 
at a price of a hundred uh, of eleven bucks. Not fair. Not only that, but it also has this awesome brand rating. And they're all buying my wine. We have this awesome overall rating versus local competitors. And the quality is awesome, as you know, the brand rating. So the price, I am tempted to, you know, how are, how's our stock? To be at full utilization. So I'm actually gonna put this price up a little, not too much, because I wanna actually decrease the margin that these guys get. We're purchasing at 11, but that'll come in now at about 15. So we've put up another five bucks and our price has gone up two bucks. Not enough. Seven. Pick out two bucks out of each bottle from these guys. Good. Turn up the speeds. Let's take a look at Dubai. How are we doing? I mean, how is Red Petal doing now that we're eating into their business? So as you can see, their quantity is actually going up, which means they probably made an adjustment to their prices. Yep. They were selling this for 400 bucks. Interesting. So we may be forced to, well, this is actually being managed by our, our friend, right? Yeah, Warren Rutledge, our new chief operating officer. You turned off your advertising to please me, but we're doing the advertising in our factory. So you can't do anything about it, pal. Great. I'm actually going to reduce this price, give him a little bit more of a space to maneuver. Same thing with the leather bags. You want to compete with me in no way. Quick acid again? No. You know what? I think I'm going to be forced to go into my game settings, my options, and disable consider tender offers. There you go. No more offering me cash for my technology. I don't even need cash, so get lost. So here is pretty interesting. We're charging four bucks and everybody's advertising with us because we got an awesome rating. I am going to be charging 410 next month, guys. Don't need the money. Take a look at leather bags. How are we doing here? Obviously made some space for them. As you can tell, he's already decreasing price. Getting this overall rating up, and the same should be happening with leather wallets. We're down to 95. Great. Gotta keep pushing these guys. Squeeze them out of the market. Next step, leather briefcase. Okay, so we need to set up the factory for that. If you don't remember, we're attacking them now from the other side here in Dubai. It's the first for us. We're gonna need a triple purchasing. All linking to our supply textiles right here. It is for our textile factory for ourselves. This is for the stupid AI. The stupid AI, but you know, competitors. Stupid because they're stupid. Now let's hook up these to our manufacturing cells. Manufacturing, manuf nope, manufacturing and manufacturing. That you do leather brief. Okay. I'll get it, guys. Don't worry. There you go. Briefcase. It's worth noting that this game actually made an update to version 1.08, and that allows the mouse wheel to work. I cannot describe how great this is. It could be better, there's some flaws, but still, it's amazing. I've lived with this game for so long without the mouse wheel. So relieving. So, how are you doing? Look at that profit. <laughs> hey, that's what I'm talking about. Now I want to compete with this guy here. So as you can tell, the wallets are going down to a loss. I think this is victory. Their bags going into loss, but this is still giving them 2 million bucks. Not forever. Other store set up right here. On the other side of the street. Leather briefcase, leather briefcase, leather briefcase, and leather briefcase. Set up advertising. One, two, three, four. Link to our news. Use no our TV station. Set you up to maximum training. Bring your price down to a comfortable seventy bucks. 
versus their 1,000. What's this? Are you selling leather bags, really? Where are you? Actually, swap products. I cannot believe this. You're not supposed to do that. Better products to sell? No, look for better supplies. For now, a little bit more salary. No, no. You're not selling? No. Do not eat you. That guy? 100% leather bags, pal. Not supposed to change that. Keep it that way. Really, really squeezing them hard. <laughs> I love this. How are you doing? They're frozen. You see the ticks here going? This guy's not advancing. January 25th already. Boom. Yes. Yes. Look at that. Ah, the smells of victory. I can start to, s to feel it. Other wallet, how are we doing here? Are we not aggressive enough here? Is that a sign? That if we let Warren take care of the store, he would be doing better. Gotta make sure we have enough leather though. Well, we have plenty. Good. Now, quality level 84, however. Battery here is plentiful in supply, which is interesting. So, yes, I think that is a sign that we will need to start being more aggressive with wallets. But instead of me doing that myself, while well, already pretty high in the levels, I'm gonna. Let Warren start playing around with Houston. Advertising here because Warren tends to disable my advertising. Very, very mean of him. How's the newspaper stand doing? This is an independent one. They're actually making some profit. Advertising for our little buddies. Oh, if you take a look at our newspapers. Lost, nobody wants. To Pay three twenty, huh? Hmm, three bucks. Some people are willing to pay for my radio station. <clears throat> Our thirty four rating. Hmm. I'll put your budget up. Why not? Same thing for the newspaper. I think this newspaper is where it really is going to be able to attack that government's newspaper stand. I'm going to set your price actually to $2.90. Is an all out attack on the newspaper front. Now, I see some interesting R&D coming out. We've got textiles, leather bag, and leather briefcase. So this, I think this will be the final blow for Red Petal's leather business. Textiles are up to 254, which is great. I know that, well, mm, well, we're at 118. Jump to 181, that's a top tech, so we're production quality at 50. Raw material is at 49, because cotton comes out really, really well. 98, as a matter of fact, let me actually see here. The next batch will come out at 100, so it's just a matter of clearing our inventory. This one, more specifically, I'm going to clear you immediately. I want that extra little point. Two little points of quality there. Awesome, we're doing it. So let's go back to our textiles R&D. Got a three-year project that can terminate this and start a longer-term project. Let's go for ten years. Five hundred points. It's gonna be great pressure all around the board. So leather bags. This is an another important tech which has just rolled out. Do I want to go 227? I don't know. Uh, let's take a look at what our friends of Red Petal have in terms of R&D. Technology. Their wallets. Well, they are actually at 280. F 
2019 going for 264. Okay, leather bags. They're far behind us. They're going to pass us actually. Well, actually they're in front of us. Okay, they're in front of us in both leather briefcase and leather bags. So we're gonna to want to apply these immediately. They're going for a reasonable 170 and 146. So I am going to be tempted to keep on pushing for another two-year project. They're at one unit and one unit. Yes, we can definitely keep up with that. So let's get right back to where we were. What was it? Another briefcase. I'm gonna keep you at two year project to go for 224. I'm gonna apply all your technology. The full production quality, so we're actually gonna pass them in that regard. Excellent. That's the leather briefcase. One more round of two year projects. So you, leather bags, same thing. Production quality is 46 out of 50, but boom, 50 out of 50. There you go. We're maxed out. Excellent. How's the wine doing? Just for me to see. We're actually selling to everybody, but demand has fallen, which is good. We weren't keeping up. We should increase prices here. I'm going to increase prices. Pressure on those guys that are buying my wine. It's coming at an awesome quality level. Snacks. What still in a nuisance here? You know what? Twenty nine, new price. You're a level nines all around, so I'm gonna take you off training. For supermarket, Just go off training, level nine. So use level five. I gotta keep you running. And there's our wine. So as you can tell, that price hike really, really hurt demand. I'm gonna put it down to. 50 bucks. A little bit more attractive. Move a little bit more wine around. Nine. So that was actually our first supermarket to be all level nines. There's our wine right there and there's supermarket. Okay, so I'm gonna call that an episode. And yeah, see you guys next time. We're gonna keep on pushing. I think this is the final blow for our little pals I, I think it's worth taking a look here let's get look at their products at their wallet so oh, they're down they're down another 20 million as for us other oh, wallets we're not making much of a profit but soon taking over this if you even take a look at our person in report no uh score report dominated products leather jacket grape juice Wine, leather bag, leather briefcase, leather wallet, food snacks. We've dominated, guys. That's what matters. So I think, I think we're we're getting there. Their profit's still a lot higher than ours, but you know that's because we're investing a lot to hurt them. So that's great. Thank you so much for watching. I'll see you guys next time.